Hey there everybody, welcome back to Toy Notes. I'm happy you're here because I'm playing My Little Pony and I'd like you to come along for the ride. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out and you can follow along with our My Little Pony review. So guys, we're playing My Little Pony. This is the Explore Equestria line and this is the Crystal Empire Castle. It's rated for kids three and older. We've got a sneak peek at our two friends, Princess Candace, or Cadence, sorry, and Baby Flurry Heart. So let's go ahead and get this unboxed. That way we can play with it and see with all the pieces it comes with. This is definitely going to be a, some adult assembly required. There are some instructions and it does take three AA batteries to get started. There's also some stickers um, and all these pieces to snap together. I have one complaint about the packaging on this. It was kind of hard to get um, Princess Cadence out particularly. And the way her hair was packaged, just look at how crazy that is. It just doesn't, it's not good. It's not a good look. And there was no brush or anything, so I might have to steal some doll brushes or something because I just don't think that even looks good. <laughs> mm. So um, let's go ahead, put it together, bring you guys in for a closer look, and then we'll have our final review. So I'm going to show you a little bit about the My Little Pony Explore Equestria Crystal Empire Castle. Phew, it's a big, long mouthful. The adult assembly that was required actually went really smoothly. Everything just snaps together. There's no screws, nothing to mess with. Um, you have to put the stickers on, but the instructions are very helpful showing where they go. And then inside, there's a big bag full of accessories. We have our princess pony here. She's wearing one of her accessories as a tiara, and she can wear this little armor kind of like dress thing. We have two thrones, one for Baby Flurry Heart, who's chilling out here in the swing, and one for our bigger doll. A mirror, a comb, and several very small pieces that I'll show you up close. There we go. So we've got a tiara, another little tiara for Baby Flurry Heart, and a cup, some little clip-on accessories for their legs. There's lots of little things going on here. So looking at the castle itself, you're going to need three AAA batteries to get running. You've got Baby Flurry Heart who is in her little swing over here. It swings freely. She's hanging out, loving it. And not a lot going on the front. But when you turn it around to the back, you've got these little turn dials where you can put all the little accessories on for display in the castle. And then you might be wondering what this is. Well, if I bring you in a little closer, now you can see on the platform, this is a little heart dial and it's a button. So when I press it, you see the lights flashing here? Well, what's really cool is what you're about to see down there. So the lights from the pedestal up here flash below and they change colors based on when you press it. And that turns it off. Now there's no included songs or sounds or anything like that. The only cool thing that this thing does is the lights. Um, I really think it could have been better if there had been some songs involved. I just don't know that there's a lot going on with this enough to keep attention for very long unless your child or you are super into My Little Pony. Well guys, that's it for us today playing with the My Little Pony Explore Equestria Crystal Castle. There's certainly a lot to do with this in terms of accessories, but I fell kind of short. It fell short of my expectations with the light show. It's cute, but I think it would have been better if there had been kind of some sounds that went with it, a little song or something. 
Um, I think this is a good starting point if you're really into My Little Pony, but it didn't really blow me away compared to some of the other castle sets I've been playing with lately. Um, I played with a My Little People, or two My Little People kinds of sets that I thought were excellent. So make sure you check those out. Uh, obviously those are my, not My Little Pony, but they did offer a little bit more in terms of entertainment and longevity of play value. Um, so I think they're worth a look at. And until next time guys, make sure you're subscribed right here at Toy Notes and give us a big thumbs up. And don't forget to check out those videos at ToyNotes.com. Until next time guys, see you soon.